we're about to go and break the siege. No, that's not right. Storm Talmberg. That's what we're going to do. We are the besiegers. We're not breaking the siege. We're going to go and storm Talmberg. I think that's the plan for tonight. I think. Unless I get distracted. It does happen. Not very often. But it does happen. Let's go and see. Let's go and see what we're up to. So, on the quest for the Rocketeer, we've got to go back and inform our non-military engineer that the military engineer is on his way, I think. And for the siege, uh, I think we maybe need to ask around the camps if people need help. Damn. So, we've got the beer. We've got the meat. Got to tell the quartermaster to send for pitch. I think there's some more asking around the camps to do here. I don't think we're done yet. <clears throat> yeah, I knew I've made a bit of progress since your last watch. Have you been absent that long? Um, I think I came to the end where I'd maybe just done all the side quests and I thought, you know what, it's time just to plow ahead and get on with things. Also, it did help that I, I finished that monastery quest. That one was a bit of a beast and that took a while. Oh, I need to go to this place up here and ask there for more beer. And then back to here, which is kind of on the way. So let's go and do that. But let's get my horse into action first. There she comes, running from the stables. Where she's being nicely saddled, liveried, all ready to go. Let's get on the march to Samo Pesh. Sounds like the name of some guy from... Ah, uh, oh, what's that? What's that? Um, what's that BBC program? Where they're set in the Caribbean, the crime drama, comedy thing. Death in Paradise. Old Sam O'Pesh who runs the boat shed down at the docks. <laughs> hey, Modge Father. How's it going? Uh, oh, you missed all the monastery quests, Dan, you? Well, too stressed to catch the streams. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I guess life just gets a bit hectic. I hope everything's okay, though. And I hope that you're feeling a little bit de-stressed now. Cookie started playing Dragon Quest 11. Have I seen Dragon Quest I don't think I've... Oh, hang on. Is that the one that just came out? Because I think I saw Dan's Gaming playing a little bit of it. I'm not familiar with the Dragon Quest games, unfortunately. Uh, okay, we'll just we'll just wait off into the stream. Now then. Apparently there is an inn in this place, although I know little of it. This must be one of the few places I have not frequented in my drinking exploits as Henry... Oh, you're just trying it out, eh? Cool. Hang on, that's not the right place. Am I... Am I too early for the inn? I think it's maybe this one, actually. What the hell? This would make more sense. This looks more inn-like, doesn't it? And it's still locked. Maybe... Oh, no, you're a villager. You're no good. I need to see the head honcho. Do I really want to wait an hour? I don't see that I have much option. What time does the inn open around here? It could be open for breakfast. So what's these Dragon Quest games like then? Because Is that the, the cutesy anime style one? Or am I thinking of something else? This is the man I need to see. Right, he's going to come out now. What are you doing here? I love that accent. That proper bohemian hey. accent. <laughs> what's up? Come on. Come on. Come on out. I need to speak to people. God be with you, Henry. No, I'll speak to you. Am I in the right place, even? Because surely that would say I'm in the wrong place altogether. It's not showing up properly on the map. Maybe I was right the first time. Maybe it is this one after all. Okay. This makes more sense now. Someone sat outside and it's open. Right. So who's? Oh, okay. Is this the innkeeper having breakfast? Thank you, alas. <laughs> Japanese RPG, so cutesy anime me. stuff all the way. I thought that was the one. I need to bring a <clears> few <throat> kegs of beer back to Talmberg. I've hardly any beer left, but I have got a lot of goat's milk. Do you think that might lift their spirits? Uh, well, I wouldn't thank you for the stuff. That's the end of that, then. See you later. <laughs> and that's a no in that case. I was going to say, yeah, I'll take that, but... I think it would be the option. Not that I've got anything against the idea of goat's milk. It's just that I don't like the stuff. 
Partly because I used to keep goats on the farm as a kid. When I say as a kid, I meant as a, as a child, not as a juvenile goat, of course. <laughs> that would be a strange transformation indeed. Let's fast travel to Mehrjed. No, oh, who wants to not let me? No. Is it because I'm in a house? There we go. And uh, yeah, I've had I've had oh, attack on the road. I'll tell you the story in a moment. Hang on, I think I'm spotted. Attack on the road. No attackers. Does that mean they are in the bushes? What weapons have I got equipped? Long sword. And oh hang on. Have I got the right arrows? Yes. Okay, let's let the hunter. Let the hunted become the hunter. Get that right, Mark. I was a baby goat once. <laughs> I'm trying to think of a witty comeback to that, but there isn't one. I suppose I could say, nah, I was just kidding. That can go in the dad jokes. So where are these sneaky ambushers? No, that is an impenetrable wall of hedge. You know what? I might just I might just run around and purposely aggro them like that. Unless they're stuck on the other side of the bushes and they can't get out to attack me, that would be quite funny. Well I see no sign of vile bandits. Here we go. There's no one there. They must have been further up the road. Or I missed them all together. Full camo skill, these bandits, yeah. <laughs> right, okay, unless it's on the other side. They're hiding behind this. Nope. What's that? No, just a weird shadow. I thought it was like... I thought it was like a grave cut. Right, anyway, so, yeah. Back to goats, because they're an important story. Yeah. So I've twice eaten goat produce in my life. Well, probably more than that. But uh, I had curried goat when I was on honeymoon in the Caribbean, on Tobago, because the guidebook said, you've got to try this. It's the local delicacy. It's fantastic. So I thought it'd be like a, like a lamb curry. And it wasn't. It was like a stinking old goat. And every mouthful tasted like the goat house used to smell on the farm back as a kid. It was, it was just disgusting. It wasn't some local delicacy at all. It was vile. And the other time was when I accidentally ate goat butter, staying at a friend's house, and she was dairy intolerant, so she used to have goat milk and goat butter. And she didn't tell us that. Her husband wasn't, so he'd have regular butter. Came down one morning, they said, make yourself some toast. So I did. Put some butter on it from out the dish, took a bite, and I said, I think your butter's gone off. And she said, no, that'll be the goat butter you've used. So... <laughs> No, I'm not a fan of goat anything. Why are we talking about goats anyway? Why do they come into the come into the story? How the hell did we get into that subject? Dunno. Hey Deathman, how's it going? I uh, did you send me a World of Tanks replay today? I saw something came in come in from someone called Deathman. A coincidence. Right, let's yeah. go and get this handed in. Goat's milk at the tavern. That was why we were talking about goats. Yeah, I knew I wasn't wandering off on too much of a tangent. Bit of... Do you know, I've never killed a cow in this game. Do you think you can get beef off them? Shall we have a go? I've never done this. Just for the hell of it. To say we've now tried everything. Oh, shoot it right in the udder. Doink! <laughs> That felled a cow. One arrow dropped a cow. I can loot it. And it's full of... Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at that. I could... Right, that's perfect. For... I'm going to take 200 of that back to hand in again for this repeatable meat quest. Wow. Okay. I do feel a bit bad for killing a cow like that, but I mean, it's to feed the army, so... They would have done it. They would have done it in those times. Oh, it wasn't you? 
It wasn't you that sent the replay in Deathman? Okay. There must be another Deathman out there. Yeah. An imposter, perhaps. Hmm. <laughs> I've got beef now, Cookie. Henry, Who the hell was that? Came. Just a wayfarer. Yeah. That was utterly ridiculous. I see what you did there. Project MGRNJ. I see what you did. And I fully approve. <laughs> Man, all that time I was going hunting game and stuff. I could have just walked into the fields here and butchered the local cows. That would have been so much quicker. Just put that bow away, Henry, before you go into camp. Hey, Green Tea, am I completing this game 100%? And how many hours has it taken? I shall let you know in a moment. I'll just get parked up safely in the camp. Put the uh, horse brake on so it doesn't roll off down the hill without me. Right, then. so there should be a guy around here somewhere. There he is. Right, just park the horse there. Let's have a look, shall we? Hours. General. Time in playline. 4.7 days. So when it gets up to 4.10... Well, five, as it's also known. Uh, that is 120 hours. So I'm not far off. I'm not far off 120 hours. Which is a long time. And I would love to 100% it, but I know for a start, there's one quest that's kind of bugged. Because I might have messed it up um, that I can't fully do. And there's probably other ones I've missed as well. So it won't, day to you. won't be quite 100%, but it's close. I've brought... Meat. I brought you some meat. Don't ask where it came from. Stack it over here. Oh, uh, this is marked as stolen beef. Are they going to care? That's the lot. Apparently not. Good. Well, thanks very much. And when you've got more, feel free to stop by. You won't be unwelcome. Oh, yes. And here's a little something for the trip. I mean, I would love to 100% this, but I, I suspect there's some little bits of story and quest that I have missed or somehow side-passed and bypassed and won't be able to activate again. I don't know. I've arranged some beer for you from the local tavern. Beef You're and beer. You're a proper treasure, you are. <laughs> I'm going to put a word in about how well you look after us. Like your own kith and kin. You do so. The charcoal burners nearby have some stocks of pitch they'll let us have. That's handy. So Robard will be pleased. What little we had left was running out, and he was getting worried. Well, he can stop worrying. Good. I'll get someone to take care of it. God be with you. Good stuff. You're 117 hours into this, and you don't feel like you're near 100% at all? I might not be. Um, I was, I'm was. i guessing that it might be completable tonight. I don't know, because I really don't know what happens after we lift the Siege of Talmberg. Good day, Henry. I might be completely wrong, and there might be like uh, a couple of dozen hours left in this. Talk to Captain Bur- oh, was he right here? I suggest he's around here somewhere. Where is that sneaky Captain Bernard? He's not in there. Is that him? Nope. Right, he's over this way somewhere. I did pass him, didn't I? Riding into the camp. Here he is. God grant you health. How may I help you? No, let's ask him how he is. Let's be polite. How goes it, Sir Bernard? How goes it? We're sitting here under the castle and all day long there's folks hewing stones. <laughs> My ears are ringing as if I'd been struck on the head. Which is just how I feel. I felt that way too since the night of the attack. That went horribly wrong. And even so, we were lucky. Could have gone much worse. I enjoyed that raid. Okay, well that's good. You're trying 100% Witcher 3? Wow, that'll be a challenge from what I've been led to believe. Oh, Deathman, you can finally stop by and watch you got a doctor's appointment. I hope there's nothing too serious there, my friend. I hope it's just a routine thing. And you think the new DLC should release this week, right? I Yes, I think it's rumoured to. It's very close. Which means I have to try and finish this and play From the Ashes before that starts. So that's going to be some, How are the men holding some up? challenge. They're a rabble. The out-of-towners are desperate to go home. And the locals, they've got nowhere else to go. So they're just generally complaining. Are they causing trouble? No trouble as such. 
It's true, I've caught a few of them asleep on their watch. But there's nothing a couple of lashes of the whip can't cure. Nice. Well, there might be a simpler solution. Whipping a man, simple enough. Just give one of them a beating, the others will remember. And when they forget, do it again. But that then you'd have an simple. injured soldier. It occurred to me a herbal oh, potion God. might do the trick. I never heard of any wives' quackery helping <clears throat> troop morale. But Christ knows they could do with something to flush the booze out of them and keep their eyes open. Oh, I wish I could, uh, wish I'd picked that up before. Oh, I've got to go off to the herbalist Hi. now. Oh man, definitely that sounds nasty. Well, I hope that's okay. And uh, don't spread it to me. I've heard these internet viruses can spread across the world. So, you know, stand back from the screen. How many Groshen do I have? 166,000, which should be enough to breeze through the next uh, expansion. What's on the menu after KCD? Um, I finish off Assassin's Creed Black Flag. And by the time I've done that, I've still got some older games I could put on as fillers, but there should be Fallout 76 out by then, I think. And by the time I finish that, Battlefield 5 might be out. So, well, I know you don't necessarily finish Fallout 76, but you know what I mean. By the time I finish playing with it. Is that where we're going? Oh, God, there's three different herbalists to talk to here. Hmm. I bet I get the wrong one. It's going to... It's, it's, Guaranteed to be, isn't it? Is there an easy way up that massive cliff? I'll go this way. I'll finish from the ashes fast enough. How about you then, Cookie? How much cash have you got? We'll, we'll have a cash off competition. Because I have no idea how much money other people make in this game. It's just that I am a terrible hoarder in RPGs. I try and pick up everything I find and sell it and hoard it, and I never use anything. Because I always think it might come in more useful later on. <clears throat> yes, I will try out Witcher 3. I want to try that too. Ooh. Is this a random encounter? Or is that just a knight? Let's have a quick word. Just a guard. I hope I can be of help to you, knight. How are things with you? I'm worried. I have a bad feeling about all this. It's a different How voice. About? I couldn't say. I just feel it in my guts. Like when you eat something bad and you have to keep running to the outhouse. Or maybe I ate something bad. Nice. Okay. I think he's one Take of the... Now. He's the equivalent of a Star Trek red shirt, I think. I think he's going to die in the assault. <laughs> we could kick Bernard's ass. I like kicking Bernard's ass. Training with the uh, the clubs. Yeah, Witcher 3, I've got to fit that in somewhere. <clears throat> um, brand new releases, if I happen to own them, take priority. But um, other than that, anything goes. Is this the... No, it's not. And it's probably... Right, I'm just going to follow the arrow. We'll go cross country. We're up, we're up. An interesting sight. I think I've been there before. There's a bit of treasure hunting to do in this. Not that I need it, but it's it's kind of nice to finish stuff off. Oh, is this the Wild Woman of the Woods? I don't know if I've found this one before. This doesn't look familiar. Witcher 3 is amazing, and I should play that. I do like the idea of playing more story-driven roleplay games on the stream. I think the good ones certainly fit this very well. Should I just... Um, there's got to be someone to talk to out here. Where's she gone? Anyone see her? Is that her asleep? Oh, she's there. She sat on the bench. Nursing her, um... Be a bit more what the hell's that? Nothing what in the bottom it? of that cup. Weird. Oh, you're having a movie night tonight? So you're going to bug out the stream with some friends? Um, Back to the Future Marathon. Awesome. We did that with the family a little while ago. I thought I need to introduce the kids to some quality 80s movies. I need something to keep our soldiers away. Enjoy it anyway. Do you know of anything that might help? I do know of a concoction to ward off sleep. I can teach you how to make it if you like. 
Um, hmm. But I need enough for at least a hundred people. <laughs> I can't help you with that. You'll have to brew oh, up a bit at a time as it's needed. So, do you want to do it or not? This That'd better be, be a helpful. joke of some sort. Do I need to tell her this? I was at the Ujit's women's Sabbath. And how did it turn out? Badly. The women were making such a ruckus, the woodcutters took them for witches and burst in on them. They meant to kill them. Jesus Christ. And how did it end? The women are dead. The woodcutters killed them. Oh, sweet Jesus. How could mm. this happen? The women meant no harm. It's your fault. They just wanted to help people and then this. Why? Why didn't you do something? I think I helped the woodcutters, as I recall. Couldn't? <laughs> Don't you have a tongue in your head to explain what was really going on? Don't you have your hands to thwart the woodcutters with? Of course you could have done something. It's just that you didn't. Holy Mother of God, you're my witness. I meant no harm. Forgive my sins and have mercy on me in my final hour. You have to confess, and which... you, you'd better go. Oh. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> nice ending remark there. Hmm. Hey, Big Duck, how's it going? You see, that quest, there was no good way to, to do that quest at all. Um, I Hello. either... I either upset. Can I get a training offer? Would you teach me something about medicinal herbs? Are you serious? You want me to teach you after what you did here? Oh, well, that's that one out the window then. Um, yeah, I either killed the woodcutters and saved the witches and then got into trouble for killing innocent men who were doing God's work, or I killed the witches and let the woodcutters go free, and everyone hates me for doing that as well, so... Uh, that is pretty tough. How many of these damn potions do I need? 60? How the hell am I going to get 60 potions? I better go and talk to the other ones, I think. But we'll start with this. A recipe for a witch potion, I love that. I thought there'd be a load of potions in there. I'm disappointed. Not that I need a witch potion, but you never know. Right, okay. That's... Oh, God, I hope I haven't dumped a load of herbs that I need for brewing this thing. Witch 3 is three years old now and fun. Though, uh, though AC0 is? Oh, a... Um, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Okay. It really hasn't caught up with Witcher yet. Similar style games. Yeah, I think, I think it's good that the... Well, maybe it's good. That the Assassin's Creed have decided to do more of a role-play game type of feel to it. Well, I must admit, I quite like the simplicity and the directness of the Black Flag game. Uh, knowing where your targets are and stuff. That's divish, right? I've got no more quest markers for this. Is this it? This is... This is go and brew 58 potions. Well, chat. Here we go. I'll try and make this as entertaining as possible. Actually, I should very soon be able to pick up the auto-brew feature for this. Let's have a little look. What do I need? I should have loads of stuff in my um, horse. On my horse, not in my horse. Uh, you're well, Big Duck. Cool. Been training a noob in World of Tanks. Good luck with that. I should have maybe looked at the name of this potion. There is a cockerel potion. That's the one, isn't it? Valerian and mint. I'm going to regret this if I don't look at... If I make loads of the... Whoops. If I, if I make loads of the wrong one, I'm going to really regret this. Optional. It says optional. Get the potion some other way. I could steal a load. I think it means cockerel potions. It's not actually saying it anywhere. Let me have a look. Cockerel potions. 
cockerel potion too. That's got to be it, right? It'll go up as soon as I try and brew some more. So I need all the valerian and mint off the horse. Oh, I bet I don't have any valerian. Mint is enough. Valerian is non-existent. Bollocks. Where am I? Oh no, there's 90 down there. That's, that's, might be enough. Hi, Predator. Nice to see you again. How's it going? Your Henry's not doing too bad, Cookie, with 149k groschen. Builds up when you don't spend it, doesn't it? Right, let's get some of this going. Amazon Prime for the potions. That's a good idea. Right, let's skip through these. I reckon I can fairly quickly brew some of these up. And then... Um, I don't know what my other options are, apart from stealing them. The auto-brew. I'm nearly, I'm nearly at the auto-brew point, so we'll do that. Spirit, one valerian, two mints. I've got enough. Grind the mint. Boil the mint for one turn. Boil valerian for two more turns. Okay, so two of mint. All right then, let's prepare. Oh my god, spirits. Did it say distill at the end? I can't remember. Hi, Shockerek. What did you miss? Um, Henry's trying to get Talmberg stormed and trebuchet built, but apparently I have to brew 60 potions to keep people from falling asleep on duty. So you haven't missed much so far, apart from me murdering a cow. <laughs> Where's the radio? Yeah, it'd be nice to listen to some music while brewing all this crap, wouldn't it? Right, so we grind that. Go on, grind it away. Go for it, son. Give it some. All right, so your Henry's already done from the ashes. You are storming on. So we use that in there. Right, so we boil that for one turn. Give it some heat. And then we get Valerian. Please, I hope this goes fast. We dump that in. We boil it for two turns. At least I think we boil it for two turns. 